Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer and welcome back to another Oblivion video. I know I said it was going to be gone until the end of August, but I just said no, I needed a week off. So in this video we're going to talk about why you should level up the blocking skill in Oblivion. And basically, when you level up, depending on what skills you leveled up in that main level depends on what stats go up. And block stat is endurance. And if you level up your endurance, um, then your health goes up which is extremely important but not only is a high health in oblivion usually always important like the way that the game is it tries to play itself like oh you can do stealth this or magic that or some other thing that but no oblivion is by far a very heavy combat game so the reason why you need to level up your block is for the health part of course but not only that it gives you some really cool perks, such as like stumbling people back and paralyzing them, that can really add to your build a lot. Because unlike Skyrim, in Oblivion, you can't wield two swords, at least vanilla Oblivion. So if you have a dagger, a short sword, or a long sword, or an axe, or a mace, then literally not using a shield is dumb. Like, there's no reason to not have a shield. Right now, obviously, you know, it gives you damage reduction too, but... It's more for, for those stats. You know, even just carrying a shield, like, maybe you're using a two-handed thing and you need to, like, disable the enemy or maybe they, you know, they drop their weapon because they hit your shield. Something like that. You can create some cool metas where you go to, like, shield and then you block them, they drop their weapon, you paralyze them, then you beat the crap out of them with a sword or you drop, they drop their weapon, gives you time to heal and then you can do the finishing blow. You have... Umbra, you can just use Umbra with a shield. All these weird, um, weird combos that you can put together with the shield special abilities. And not only that, it gives you an extra armor piece to enchant. Anything you want, right? Because it's a defense. You can enchant it with whatever stats and just add to the list of enchantments that you have for yourself. Now, it would get kind of weird if you have to take off the shield to wield a bow or a sword. You know, you got to make sure that your enchantments are right. But, like, even something like a protect or maybe it fortifies a skill. Like, maybe it even fortifies your blocking more. Something that would really bump up the use of the shield. Because, like, the, sh the shield, it, it just it's basically an extra line of defense that is also a multi-tool and it, the shield doesn't have to be heavy or light armor that gives you the same effects except the heavy armor ones i guess in hindsight heavy armor slower but more effective but i mean that's pretty much logic anyways and again just like with any skill where you want to bump up your health or something block is really easy to level up like armor is really easy to level up heavy armor is easy to level up and block is easy to level up Really, all you got to do, this is, by the way, if you want to pump up your health fast, just stand there with, like, an iron shield or something in the beginning of the game and just, like, hold it and just let everything beat the crap out of the shield. Then when it breaks, you repair it and do it again. That's how you power level your endurance really fast. And then when you don't need to level up your endurance anymore, you just strip yourself down, put on some light armor, and do some kind of fencing technique or magic, and then you level up yourself, and then you, you have an insane amount of health. It's actually a really good meta. Leveling up your health is a lot easier than it seems, especially when you incorporate block into it, because block adds to that endurance stat buff. And that's really it for this video. It's pretty short. Um, I mean, it's just why you should level up block in Oblivion. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more Oblivion videos. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or Steam it post of whatever I decide to make.